Hi guys, you're watching GT Channel and today I'm doing out Terraquali Battleground. So this is gonna be the final BG for this week. And the next week I'm gonna go back to leveling and doing some dungeons. And because I already completed all the classic dungeons in the game, got the achievement, so now we're gonna start doing the Burning Crusade ones, the ones that are located in the Outlands territory. Pretty excited to see how they're gonna look and what kind of rewards I'm gonna get from those new dungeons in the Outlands. So anyway, here we go. We are going all together towards the fierce boss that is located in the Ice Blood Garrison. So damn, this is quite a big group of people here. It looks like a train of people. Look at this, damn. Looks pretty amazing. It's like a race. The first person to get to the to the boss gonna win a medal or something like that. So here we go, going for the boss. Already approaching the Ice Blood Garrison, so now we're gonna go inside and kill that damn orc. And it's pretty smart to do this at the beginning of the game to go and kill your enemy's mini boss because after we're gonna kill this Captain Orc guy, the horde gonna lose 100 points. So that's why it's so important to kill the damn boss at the beginning of the match. And it isn't that hard to kill him, look at this, we have about like, how many people do we have here? About like 10 people here and we have no problems taking him down. He is already at half health and he's almost dead already. Few more pushes, few more hits and the damn half naked or gonna go down. And he is dead, that's it. He just got a lot of experience, one panda got level up even, that's just insane. So now let's go move on to the next base. I'm thinking going straight to their main base. Gonna skip all the towers on the way. So let's go. Just gonna go straight to the main horde base. Because, well, it's kinda boring to like uh, stay on top of the tower and wait for it to burn. I want to go where is the action going on. And it's gonna be at the horde base. So as you can see, this tower is already captured by the alliance. So they don't need any more help. At the moment at least. So let's just move on. I'm gonna follow those, those party members that are going ahead of me. There are some wolves and look at that, there's the horse coming from the left side but they are avoiding the fight. They are afraid to die because we have way more people right here coming this way. They will be like crushed if they will try like to attack us. But anyway, this is already the frost wolf village. Let's go. Let's go up. Damn it, stupid cliff, there are a lot of NPCs in this damn village. Gonna avoid all of them and let's go inside to the left. This is the main base of the hordes. Frost Wolf Keep, yes. Finally, I am right here. And there are no hordes here, damn it. So I think I'm gonna go and try to capture this tower right here. I'm gonna kill this damn guard. Wow, look at the guards. The guards do quite a lot of damage. It's quite annoying. And I still didn't update my addons. I always keep forgetting to update some of my damn addons. So as you can see, some of their like health bar going apeshit at this moment. Look at that, damn. I need to remember to update some of my addons so they can work properly. And that was the last guard, so now gonna go and capture this tower. This tower must be captured and burn it to the ground. So let's take it. 5 seconds to go and this tower gonna become neutralized. Just took it, that's it. So now I need to like uh, stay here and wait. Wait for the horse to come to kill. And look at that, there they come already. The horse are coming from the spawn point I think, yeah. So we're gonna jump on this rogue. Come on, let's destroy him. Damn it. For some reason he absorbed most of my damage and he got full health back. How the hell did that happen? I guess there was some kind of son of a bitch healer here. That healed him and I could not kill this guy. So this is gonna be my second attempt at trying to kill this damn panda and he is dead. Nice. So time to escape and go back into the steel. Cause my one ish ability is on cooldown. Need to wait a few seconds. Some of my party members are healing me. Very nice heals. And damn, there's a lot of hordes here at this place. So gonna jump on this cow. Come on. Dealing some damage to him, ambushes. Few more hits and he gonna go down. And yes, he just got destroyed. Nice. 
But now I'm attacked by a lot of people right here and things doesn't look good. At this moment I'm totally getting destroyed by them. Have shitload of dots on me. Trying to escape and god damn it. This son of a bitch that night pulls me and they just finish me off. Oh my god look how many there were whores there. Got respawned at the middle of the map so now I have to go all the way back and look at that what do we have here? Gonna sub this guy. It's a, it's a dead knight so let's open him. Cheap shot, ambush and he's dead. Wow how the hell did he die so fast? I guess with the help of the guards he just got destroyed. Damn that was a very fast kill right there. So anyway now I, I have to go all the way back to the main base god damn it. Respawn point was at the middle. So first I'm gonna check out this bunker. Is there any horse right there? No it's safe. Wow this is the first time I discovered the stone heart bunker. That's quite lame. And I see a lot of horse passing by here. Trying to sub someone so just gonna jump on this guy. The dead knight. Let's destroy this guy damn it. You're gonna die you bastard. So he put some damn dots on me and damn it I just got pulled away by some other dead knight. So gonna blind one of them. Trying to escape popping my cloak of shadows. And going into the steel. Nice and look at that that guy just died from my dots. Oh my god I can't believe that. So okay gonna wait for some alliance to come here because it's very very dangerous to go alone by myself. But anyway gonna try to go on this shaman guy, destroying the shaman, cheap shooting, dealing some damage, mutilating him and he's almost dead come on, yes he just got owned. And there are some other people that are trying to kill me, damn bastards are focusing me and I don't have my vanish ability ready so I cannot escape this. But there they are, the reinforcements, the alliance came so now I am total safe here. So going back into the steel. Jumping on this other cow, big cow on a horse and he just got destroyed by us. Nice we have very big group right here. So the horse don't stand a chance they like come one by one and they just die. Just insane. So I'm trying to go reach this druid guy popping my trinket and let's open on him cheap shooting ambushing and he is already dead. Damn it, everything dies way too fast in this BG for some reason. I guess it's because we have a lot of people at the same place. We have about like 10 people here. Look at this, trying to jump on that guy but he's already dead. Damn, this is just insane. And by the way we are already winning this BG. We have over 300 points and the horde has only 100 points. So we are winning at the moment. That's very nice to see. And when you win this BG, at least at this level you get about like 50,000 experience. That's just crazy amount of experience you get for playing one battleground. Just crazy experience. So now I gonna, well my mission is to return back to the, to the main horde base to kill them. And on the way I gonna try to kill some of the horse right here. So gonna try to select something, oh my god everything just dies very fast. I cannot even like select the target it's already dead. Going on this mage guy, he just got totally destroyed, some other hordes are trying to escape. And there are some other ones that are right here. So gonna open on this cat, bad little kitty gonna die, cheap shooting, ambushing. And come on one and venom and he gonna go down, yes nice crit but he didn't die. Damn son of a bitch, very tough bastards right here. So now I'm gonna wait a few seconds before I can get my restilled and gonna go back into the action. And look at this, there are so many hordes at this place, I don't even know what to attack. So I'm gonna play a little safer at the moment because you can easily die at this place. If some of the hordes gonna focus on you, you're just gonna be destroyed in a few seconds. So I'm going on this mage guy, come on you damn blood elf, come on just die and he just brings away. And now it's time to escape, so gonna try to run away, popping all of my cooldowns, my clock of shadows plus one ish, just wasted those two abilities, because there's just way too many people at this place. And you can get blown up in few seconds, if you are not very careful. The classes that have AoEs are in super advantage over melees, 
Because look at this. This is just total madness that going on right here. I have no idea what to target, what to attack. So just gonna jump on something, but it's already dead. This is just crazy shit going on. We are like pushing the hordes away from this place. Look at this. This is the magic that I wanted to kill. And I gonna try to kill him. Come on, come on. And I didn't kill him, but my water party members finished him off. But still, it's okay. We are totally pushing them away. Got rooted in the place. Need to wait a few seconds. And gonna open on this little guy. Little shaman guy gonna die. And he is down. Yes, nice. We have three times more points than the horde has. So it doesn't look very good for the horde. And damn it, that panda just like ran away. I hate that pandas have such a crazy speed buffs. They can just roll away and they have like speed increasement or shit like that. So it's almost impossible to catch them. And they have like a... Like an escape mechanism or something like that. So they always can get away from anyone. If they don't have any cooldowns on their abilities. So let's try to kill this damn cow. The cow is dead. Now let's kill another one. Let's kill everyone that is right here. The horse are totally getting crushed by us. He tries to heal but I just kick that ability. And let's move on, let's proceed to the main base. While killing the horde on the way. This is just hilarious. Total madness at this point. And damn it I got frost, you know what? Again I got revealed by someone, son of a bitch mages. Because of all these damn AOE spells I cannot like stay in still. So I'm gonna try to kill this mage but he blinks away. And I totally lost the target. But I guess my party members took care of that, of that guy. So now let's move on and proceed into the main base. We have to burn the main base and kill the main boss. Wow, there's a lot of guards here, plus some hordes and some water shit. But I gonna maybe gonna try to help out this guy. My party member is almost dead, gonna try to kill this paladin and I just like uh, rescued that guy. Because he had about like 10% health left. So I'm a hero. So let's move on into the Frost Wolf Keep and go try to burn those towers. Or maybe those towers are already burning, I don't know, let's check it out. So gonna go into the main base and what do we have here? There is a panda right there. Is he stuck or what? Oh my god, I can't see shit here. But I try to kill this panda. Keep shooting him and like hitting him and jumping, hitting him and jumping him because is he stuck here or what? I have no idea. Or maybe he was a ninja. He was a ninja that was hiding behind this behind this building trying to ambush someone but he just got killed by me. Oh my god that was insane. So anyway here we go and oh my god there is a big group of hordes at this place. And again I gonna get revealed if I'm not very careful, so gonna jump on this hunter, the damn hunter, chip shotting him, ambushing and come on few more hits and he just got owned by me. He received 2000 crit. And god damn it some elemental shamans are casting some, some crazy lighting shit at me, stop attacking me. But we have healers, it looks like we have healers in this group, that's just amazing. Damn it I cannot kill anything here. Everybody just keeps killing everything. Damn it, let me attack something. I try to kill something, but it's already dead. That's just insane. We have way too many people at the same place. So the horde has only 43 reinforcements left, so it's time to go and kill the boss. But first we must kill all the hordes before we can like go and attack the damn boss. The damn hordes are getting in our way. We must take care of the horse before attacking the boss. This is the plan. So this army is that knight so he doesn't attack me. Stop focusing on me son of a bitch. Attack someone else. And I have 4 dead knight dots on me. How the hell is that even possible? So I have to like use my clock of shadows ability to clear those damn dots and go into the steel. So just finish it off some kind of panda or 
what the hell was that I don't know it just died and received almost 4000 crit from me and again Frost Nova from some son of a bitch mage this guy right here you're gonna die you're not gonna escape from me no way no way you're gonna run away from me son of a bitch just die finally I took down the damn annoying Frost Shield and I'm doing some strange stupid shit right here look at this I just got pulled by this big group of hordes and I just got my ass kicked by them Damn, that was incredibly stupid of me to do. So I just respawned at the middle of the map and now I'm trying to get back to the horde base. But the game is over and I won this match. Very nice. I managed to get 10 kills, died 2 times and did some very average damage. But it was very nice game. So thanks for watching. Bye.